So what we're doing today, you know I'm getting into the whole vending machine business. I have my snack machine, my Pepsi machine. I'm gonna have another Pepsi machine. And a lot of people are telling me, but Reyes, you gotta raise the prices of your products. So that's what we're doing today. You know I'm gonna try beating my competition's prices. Let's see how it goes. And today we have a very special guest. We got the homie Tim. Yeah, Tim, tell, tell them about your channel, man. What you got going on? So, uh, Tim O'Loughlin on YouTube channel. I got a lot of side hustle videos, but right now, mainly, it's all vending. I've uh, got some vending machines, and I totally fell in love with them, and I, that's what I'm putting out, a lot of content. Usually three to four a week. There you go. So, you want more vending machine content? Check them out. And he actually made a drive over here, because... We're gonna go pick up a soda machine, but let's go find out my competition prices and see if we could beat them. You're down, Tim? Yeah, we can beat them. All right. How much are they? A dollar? Mm -hmm. oh, a dollar? How much are the waters? Oh, the same price. Dollar. Sold out. Sold out. So we just went to this one right here. Yo, they were charging a dollar for everything. Tim, what do you think of that, man? I don't know. The profit's got to be good on that, though. Bro, but that seems like a lot. Yeah, it's a lot. But people are buying it because they're sold out. Yeah, almost everything was sold out, huh? Even yeah. if you try getting the water. You try to get in the water. For a sold dollar, out. sold out. But maybe either they're buying it or he's just not coming and restocking. Yeah, one or the other. Yeah. And you were saying you were... You bought uh, Monsters energy drinks? So I got vending machines too, and yeah, and I've been putting energy drinks in. The guys requested it, so I thought the profit margins were pretty good on them. Wait, I mean, energy drinks, well, at least $3, no? Yeah, three, like two fifty. Two fifty? Yeah, two fifty. Yeah. But you're really only making about $0.50 cents a piece because it's hard to find them for cheap unless you can get them from where they make them like coke and like, oh like directly from the so like budweiser budweiser makes bangs yeah budweiser controls the bang so you'd have really to get, yeah so you have to get you know set up so you can do that i was telling tim that hey since they're sold out we got to put one of our own <laughs> yeah, machines right dude, next to right them next to it. and be like hey that's the machine's always sold out always just put a paper on there it says sold out even yeah. if it's not sold we'll out. Put, put a paper that says sold out and then an arrow pointing to your not sold out yeah i'll be like not sold out cool let's go to another one so we're out here trying to find some vending machines and actually it's harder than it seems, you know? Just driving around looking for vending machines. Oh, but they're bottled. Yeah. So... 175? 75. Dude, you gotta be balling over here. Two dollars for you the... You gotta be... You gotta just for the soda. And bottle. it's halfway sold out. So for the homie Tim is telling me that these bottles, they cost 175. But you're telling me that at the store they cost two twenty five. Yeah, at least two twenty. Like usually it's one ninety nine plus you know CRE and everything so, tax by the time. So they're undercutting the store somehow. somehow. So this is two dollars, two twenty five. Not available. One seventy five. Two dollars. Right, cool. Oh man. Thing. So we just came to another location, man. First of all, they were all sold out. Yeah, Damn. Always. You know always, what? Both I, spots. I feel like we always gotta have a soda machine ready. Could be like, hey, your machines out there, they've been sold out. Give ours a try. Yeah, give ours a chance. So let's go to another location. But man, in my opinion, that seemed like a lot of money for sodas. Two dollars for the orange juice, I think. Yeah. Gatorades. Makes you wonder how much they cost, right? To get them like uh to get them, even mm -hmm. if you got them wholesale. You know what? We're gonna go to Costco after this. So that way we could find out how much it's costing, how much they're making profit. Of course, you know, we don't know how much commission they're paying, but we'll give you an idea. Hey guys, these are the money makers. Nah. Tim, Tim. We can't, we can't beat these prices, bro. We can't beat the prices. We can't beat the prices. Oh, oh you didn't know? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, right there, six ninety eight. Oh, so six ninety eight for twenty four. That seems like a deal, right there. So we saw a couple vending machines. Tim, what do you think of them, man? You think they're making money? They're definitely making money. What about sure. Walmart, bro? Dude, you 50 think... cents a can? Bro! Ooh, how do you compete with that? You can't. You can't compete with that. Nah. I'm 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 a I'm a stand outside of Walmart with a basket full of soda and be like <laughs> That's the best 40, 49 cents. 49 cents. Yeah. We're at Costco. Let's see if we could get a cheaper price. How much is 36?
32 cents. So we just came back from Costco and um, to be honest, prices weren't any different than at Walmart. But what do you think, Tim? I don't know. I don't know how long. Well, I don't know. Just a couple pennies. So the way, yeah. yeah the, so a couple pennies difference. I think it was like 31 cents at Walmart. Yeah. Or 32 cents here or vice versa. Yeah. The thing that I don't like about Costco is you don't have the selection that you do at Walmart. Walmart has a lot more selection. Costco, they only have, I think, the high sellers. But you can make a pretty decent uh, profit on the 7-Ups and the Squirts because those were cheaper. You know, the sodas. yeah, but I mean, I feel like for a vending machine, you need your popular Cokes. Yeah. You know, diet, this and that. Because those will be the ones that sell. And to be, I, I didn't see a big difference. So, what I'm thinking is, if you could buy a can of soda plus a CRV for about 30, 35 cents, mm -hmm. sell it for 75, maybe a dollar. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You're making money. You're making money. Yeah. So, there you go. That's it. Hopefully, this video helped you out. At figuring out the prices. Tim, thank you for joining me today. Yeah, thanks for having me. Glad to be here. And if you want more vending machine content, subscribe and of course follow the homie Tim right here. We'll see you in our next video.